Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to change the text caret cursor blink timeout on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So if you want to go ahead and adjust that timeout speed, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in regedit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T, Best match, you'll come back to Registry Editor. You want to go ahead and right-click on that and select Run as Administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select Yes. And before you proceed in the registry, I would highly suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything were to go wrong, you could easily restore it back. In order to create a backup, it's very simple. All you have to do is select File and then Export. And then File Name, I recommend naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Set export range to all, and then save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on either your computer or an external hard drive. And once you're done with that, if you ever need to import it back in, all you have to do is select file and then import and then navigate to the file location. So now we're ready to begin, and we're going to start off by double clicking on the H key current user folder. Do the same thing for the control panel folder, and then there should be a desktop folder in here. Just left click on that. If you need to take note of our file path, it's up at the top of the screen here. Each backslash is a different subfolder we've gone under to get to this point. So if you need to pause the video, feel free. So once you're underneath the desktop folder on the right side, you want to locate the caret timeout and double click on it. So if you had to create this value, for example, if you didn't see it in here, you just would right click in a blank area and then you would select new and then do a 32 bit value. And you would name it caret timeout, double click on it. You see, in my case, it's already here, but if it wasn't, you'd have to go ahead and create it. You want to set base to decimal, and now you want to type in how many milliseconds you want the text cursor blink timeout to last. So just for reference, one second is equal to 1,000 milliseconds, and the default is five seconds. So 5,000, five 1,000 millisecond increments equals five seconds, basically. So every 1,000 milliseconds is one second. So adjust whatever time out you want here, and then you would select OK. And then once you're done, you would need to restart your computer for the change to take effect. There you go, guys, and that should hopefully be about it. So, as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.